Welcome back. Since my transition to Linux, I have acquired a culture of open source software. A culture that is expanding with every day I spend in Linux. Today, after a modest search, I am delighted to present you some of the most important open source Android application. But before starting, I would like to tell you that the video is not a tutorial or a review of the applications, but rather a sample presentation of the best Android open source application. So let's the fun begin. Number one, Launcher, the routeless pixel launcher that is both heavily customizable and ships with backported Android Oreo theaters and the Twix. Number two, Wi-Fi analyzer. It helps you to find better place for your Wi-Fi receiver. Gives you information about each one Wi-Fi channel. Show signal strength in history graph. Recommends you best channel for new IP. Number 3. CPU Info Provide main information about hardware and software of your device, such as RAM, CPU, battery, sensor, and more. Audio recorder, audio recorder with custom recording folder, nice recording volume indicator, recording notification, recording look screen activity. Number five, healthy battery, an Android application to help the user have good habits so that the battery can last longer. Number six, Authenticator Pro. Authenticator Pro is a free open source two-factor authentication app for Android. I will make a video tutorial about it in the next video, Allah winning. Number 7. VLC. VLC Media Player is a free and open source cross-platform multimedia player. 
VLC for Android plays most local video and audio files, as well as network streams like the desktop versions of VLC. It also supports disk shares. Number 8. Firefox. Needless to define, Firefox is the independent, people-first browser made by Mozilla, voted the most trusted internet company for privacy. It is fast, smart, and secure. And the most important, it is free and open source. Number 9. Barcode Scanner. Free, open source, fast, stable, and could focus with tap on the screen. It scans barcodes on products or data matrix and QR codes containing URL, contact info, etc. AntennaPod Easy to use, flexible and open source podcast manager for Android. AntennaPod is free in all sense of the word. Open source, no cost, no ads. Number 11. Orbot. Orbot brings the features and functionality of Tor to the Android mobile operating system. Orbot is an open source software and an open network that helps you defend against a form of network surveillance and threatens personal freedoms and privacy, confidential business activities and relationships, and state security now as traffic analysis. Number 12. Turbo Torrents. An ad free and open source torrent downloader available for Android with inbuilt torrent tracker and IP address tracker. Number 13. PassWD Safe. A port of the password safe application to Android. An excellent open source, reliable and easy to use app. Number 14. F-Droid. F-Droid is an installable catalog of free and open source software application for the Android platform. 
The client makes it easy to, to browse, install, and keep track of updates on your device. The application isn't available on the Play Store, but you can download it from the official website. Number 15. Sample Note. An easy way to keep notes, list, idea, and more. Your notes stay in sync with, with all of your devices for free. The Android app is free and open source. Number 16. Adaway. Adaway is an open source ad blocker for Android using the host file. Of course, the app is not available on the Google Store, so download it from FDroid or from the official website. Finally, and number 17, Fidila. Fidila is a multifunctional Android client to access the distributed Fidiverse consisting of microblogging, photo sharing, and video hosting. Download it free from FDroid. That is all, so what application did you decide to use after reading the article or watching the video? And what is the application that you did not know about it before? Let us know on the comment section. If you like my work, you can support it on Patreon and follow me on social media you can find the link below thanks for watching and see you later